Yo, what's up guys, welcome back again to another Clash Royale video. And after that beautiful intro, I have a challenge for you guys today. Me and my boy Dan the Hero, if you haven't subscribed to him, make sure you do, the link will be down in the description. Decided to ban 5 cards each, so I banned 5 cards, he banned 5 cards, 10 in total, and we're not allowed to use any of those cards in our decks. I banned the Royal Jan, the Fire Spirits, the Inferno Tower, the Ice Wizard and the Fireball and Dan banned the Hog Rider, the Valkyrie, the Prince, the Minion Horde and the Arrows. So the challenge is to attack and win without using any of those cards, it's a best out of 3, so let's get straight into the battles. Alright, so here we go, first battle against Dan, I <laughs> threw that taunt, um, so we are using some weird decks because we could not use some of the banned cards, so I have the uh, Elixir Collector, he's gonna drop a, a Goblin Barrel, unfortunately I do not have arrows because they are banned, I dropped that Poison Spell, pretty stupid, didn't actually do something that good, so pretty smart move from him to use the Goblin Barrel since he banned the arrows, and now I'm just waiting for my Elixir to fill up, I'm gonna drop the Witch over there, he Poison Spelled my uh, right tower, and my collector as well, what a little bitch. So, uh, that poison spell almost like got the witch to half health, okay. As you can see, he dropped that, those barbarians. I have that a dark prince over there, which does splash damage. I'm gonna zap all that mess over there, zap the tesla as well. And now dark prince, witch, pekka all going in. Um, the ice spirit as well. Boom, froze that shit. He's gonna drop a Goblin Barrel to distract my um, Witch, but that wasn't enough, I managed to... Did I kill the tower? No, I did not, so 92 health left, he is crying, so dropping the Collector as well, and honestly that deck really worked well, but of course you have to think that we banned some cards, so you know, so um... He has gotten my tower down to 540 health. 18 seconds until double elixir. I dropped that pack over there. Now he's gonna deploy that goblin hat like before. And I'm gonna deploy Dark Prince behind my pack as well. So um that his right tower has only 92 health left, so I'll have to waste my potion spell on that soon. I have a push over there with the witch, the dark prince. The P.E.K.K.A. and dropping a poison spell as well, now he dropped those barbarians and managed to kill them in seconds because that Dark Prince is really good against barbarians because he does splash damage, froze that tower, pretty stupid move, I didn't get the goblins and yeah, the Dark Prince got some hits from that tower, got it down to 532 health. Um, but now I dropped my collector, he's gonna throw that goblin barrel over there, I, I threw that ice spirit like it was pointless um, so uh, he got my tower he's gonna poison spell again my tower and my collector as well I'm gonna poison spell his and boom it goes down I'm gonna drop my dark prince to deal with all those goblins over there he's gonna deploy a witch I'm gonna freeze all that destroy the tesla and move towards the tower now um, so many troops are literally spread around the arena um, but now he's pushing really hard, Barbarian switch and I have no elixir at all, I dropped that poison spell, that pack over there is being retarded, um, he's gonna poison spell as well and unfortunately that's gonna be game soon, um, his tower only has 476 damage, like I could have used the rocket, we did not ban the rocket and I could have gotten that shit. Um, but unfortunately I did not think of that, so he has a goblin barrel, I'm gonna zap that, drop a poison spell as well, but I'm out of elixir and he has so many cards, it's technically impossible to defend against that, so boom, Dan won uh, the first trade, GG Dan, um, it was a really nice uh, match, of course, so uh, <laughs> he's gonna brag, as you can see over here, he says banana, okay Dan, so moving on to the second raid, here we go against Dan again, the same decks, I don't think that he changed something, I didn't change something, so I have the collector to start things off, and as you can see he drops those goblins over there, 
and now we're just waiting for the elixir to fill up. He's gonna poison spell again, my tower with my collector. Um, he's gonna throw that goblin barrel as well. I'm not gonna counter that with my witch, I do not wanna spend elixir on it. Um, so, he did some pretty solid damage to my tower. And so I'm gonna drop the Dark Prince over there. I really started liking the Dark Prince lately. I don't know why he does plus damage and it's a really good card. Like, I underestimated a lot uh, previously. So, I froze that witch. I'm gonna zap as well, moving towards that tower. Uh, it's not gonna go down, of course. Only the witch is on that tower. But I'm gonna get it down to uh, 1100 health. So, as you can see, uh, I'm gonna drop my collector as well. Over there. 54 seconds until double elixir, we still have plenty of time. And okay, so he's gonna poison spell again, like... Oh my god, Dan, why poison spell my tower? Uh, I'm gonna drop a fire spirit again, pretty stupid move, like the last raid, why the hell did I do that? So, he got my tower, which is bad so far, right? So, um, that P.E.K.K.A almost got distracted from that goblin. Uh, I'm gonna drop the witch as well, 30 seconds until uh, double elixir. Witch coming in, I'm gonna drop the Dark Prince as well, he deployed his Tesla, okay, of course he used Tesla since I'm using a P.E.K.K.A. Now I'm gonna destroy that Tesla, no problem, he's gonna zap although before, I'm gonna freeze all that and move towards his tower, I think it's gonna go down now, yes, the P.E.K.K.A is on that, the Dark Prince got the tower, and the troops are like pushing his uh, crown, tower, crown, crown tower as well, sorry. So, he's gonna poison spell, he's desperate, I know you're desperate, Dan. So, double P.E.K.K.A coming in, he killed the first one, now the second P.E.K.K.A is coming in. Uh, I'm gonna destroy that Tesla, but he zapped before my P.E.K.K.A managed to destroy that Tesla, so good game on that. And now we're tied 1-1, one to one. 38 seconds left, that P.E.K.K.A uh, got one hit from his crown tower. I have the witch over there, among with that Dark Prince, someone is cheering for me, I don't know who is live spectating the battle. But thanks, um, Goblin Barrel gonna zap that, and huge push going on there, uh, Dark Prince, Double Witch as you can see, and P.E.K.K.A on that tower, it's gonna go down, freeze, um, and yeah, it's looking good for me so far, he's gonna <laughs> throw that Goblin Barrel over there, but no, it's not gonna do that much damage, so, um, I have the Dark Prince and the P.E.K.K.A, the P.E.K.K.A has locked on that tower, Poison Spell down, there we go, Clutch win, 1-1, one to one. let's go for the last battle, it's a best out of 3, so we have one last battle, whoever wins uh, this battle gets the win, so <laughs> I said Apple, because before he said Banana, get the joke, haha, <laughs> yeah, silly joke, but um, so, last battle, let's go, so, and his excuse is that he's a level 8 though, no one believes him, he's a level 9 secretly, <laughs> nah, I'm just playing, okay, I have, I have the level advantage, okay, it's okay, <laughs> um, so, a uh, poison spell again on my collector and tower, he has done that in all of the raids so far, um, at least, like, throwing a fireball is worse than poison spell, but we've banned the fireball, so... Yeah, so, uh, P.E.K.K.A, among with that witch, going towards his tower... Come on, I wanna... <laughs> yep, there we go, I deployed it. Um, so, Dark Prince as well over there, I'm gonna zap all that, unfortunately I missed that stupid witch over there. But it's all good, cause, uh, all of the troops are still alive, Master Sen just uploaded a video, we don't give a shit. Um, yeah, so, um, pushing towards his tower, it's gonna go down, that push was deadly, uh, tower down, 1 to 0, so it's not looking good for Dan, so far, right, so, Grand Warden, okay, you're getting wrecked, mate, <laughs> so, uh, I'm gonna deploy another collector down, I suppose he's gonna drop a poison spell as well, no, he's not, by the way, uh, this is a, uh, it's a commentary, I'm not live commentating over the gameplay, uh, if you didn't notice already. Um, so, he's gonna drop the Goblin Barrel, I, I'm not gonna counter that, I'm completely fine with it. I have my P.E.K.K.A, I'm gonna drop my Dark Prince in a bit, and funnel a huge push again. So, um, I'm gonna drop the Witch. I use the P.E.K.K.A and it's a pretty expensive card, Dan did not use any expensive cards at all, like the Golem or anything like that, so... 
Uh, I think that's what made him to lose because he could not counter that P.E.K.K.A. So he dropped those Barbarians, I uh, threw that Ice Spirit on that Tesla, worked pretty well, froze all that mess over there, he's gonna drop a Poison Spell, but still I'm gonna get some solid damage from that tower, uh, got it down to 1300 health, double Elixir is on of course, so as you can see he is desperately, desperately <laughs> trying to get my tower, unfortunately, unfortunately I cannot talk, sorry. <laughs> He's not going to. I'm gonna drop the P.E.K.K.A. to like protect my tower. I'm not gonna push his tower. I'm just gonna protect mine. Um, it's a stupid move, move, okay, I admit it, but I had to protect my tower. He's gonna throw that Goblin Barrel. It's not gonna do anything. I uh, have a Witch and a P.E.K.K.A. He almost got the tower, right? If I, I was a bit careless there. He almost got the tower. He doesn't have a Fireball though. So he wasted his zap there, 4, 3 seconds, 2, 1, there we go, we got the win against Dan. So make sure you subscribe to his channel, to his channel. the link will be down below. Hope you enjoyed this uh, mini collab we did, if you have any more ideas make sure you comment down below, we can do even more in the future. Um, so yeah, make sure you subscribe to me and Dan if you haven't already, leave a like and see ya in the next one. I played the game and I'm still the same and I never changed just to get a deal but I'm ballin', ballin'. I came from nothing to something